Okay, already on day nine. And then the wheel went round and round. I could not find my way. Twelve and three and turned the key. I heard the madman say. Hello, this is Chiak. We are back again with another set of Gabriel Knight, Sins of a Father. Uh, we are within a wheel. You want I stay here, right? It's a long walk back to the city. Yeah, sure. Wait here, please. I may be a while, though. No problem. I could use a nap. Uh, how much are you paying this guy? <laughs> Gabriel's on a rise overlooking an ancient snake mound in the People's Republic of Benin. If he's correct, this is the tribal homeland of Tetelo's people. Okay. Hold on. What? Gabriel's on a If Sorry, he's correct. Hill, sky, snake mound, enter snake mound. It's the only thing we can do besides talking to the driver. But the driver's taking a nap. We are here on urgent business. Oh. Right away. This stone looks interesting. Mummy-like figures and contorted poses appear to be the only residents here. Gabriel wonders, was this a burial mound, or does their presence serve some ritualistic purpose? Also, because I forgot, hold on a sec, <laughs> I forgot, since, uh, since I had to cut between scenes just to make sure that I have a safe spot here. All right. It fits. Oh, why am I? I'm taking it off. Okay, why am I taking it off? <laughs> why am I taking it off? Okay, whatever. Uh, slots, cave painting. Yeah. Is anybody here? There is no answer. I was about to. I was wondering. The walls bear ancient paintings. The handiwork of the sun worshippers, no doubt. A vine. Can we take the vine? I have a dagger here. That doesn't work, Dad. Okay, just just a thought. The vines are thick and tough. Taking them down wouldn't be easy. What's Although the he has a playful urge to swing on those vines. Gabriel would feel a bit childish doing so without good reason. Is this all connected? Okay, let's head to the next room then and hopefully not die. From off in the mound echoes a sound like the scuffle of a shoe. Gabriel would rather not mess with that mummy. An elaborate mural with a masked design has been carved into the wall in this room. Okay. Torches light the interior of the mound. Either they burn perpetually, or someone recently lit them. Just in case, let's uh, have a flashlight ready since we have that with us. God, how did we take this knife with us in the airplane? Oh, more tiles. Okay. Seeing two tile snake, five tile snake, ten tile snake. The walls bear ancient paint. Okay, they don't say anything significant, though. Hello? Snake rod. Oh, wait, there's a towel here.
Okay. Now let's pick up the snake rod. Actually, this is the six tile snake. It's we shaped a little at. like a snake. Okay, important item. Can we look at it further? No, we can't. Okay, three tile snake. I'm gonna assume there's nothing else to look at. We're just going around the mound, obviously. Oh, there's a guy in like the bottom right corner. Or the mummy, I should say. This one, oh my god, they can't even tell. Which one's this one? Nine. Okay. I mean, it's not, we're not, unless we're getting more details with the cave paintings. It's stuck. Okay, so this An one's a fix. An stone is on the wall. You gonna tell me hello? Uh, three, six, nine, twelve. An etched stone. Oh. What about the snake rod thing? The rod fits into the hole in the stone. Nothing happens. Cause that's twelve. Is anybody here? There is no answer. Sorry, I just wanted to see. The walls bear ancient paintings. Can In the center of the wall painting is a square sunken area. Hmm. So I wouldn't know what to do with it right now. So back behind me is 12. We grabbed the four tile. Gabriel has the creeping sensation that he's being watched. So it's like, it's 12 the biggest number. Eight. So let's see, 10, five, two, six, three, nine, four, eight. Still missing a few numbers here. This one is 11. Okay, so 12 might be the biggest number. Gabriel has the creeping sensation that he's being watched. We still haven't found the one. Okay. If there is a one, a shadow flickers in the corner of Gabriel's eye. Okay, this is steadily getting worse. Because I wasn't counting, so... Because it does make a, a round circle. A shadow flickers in the corner of Gabriel's eye. Okay, so this was the 12th tile. I'm thinking now it goes one, two, three. From off in the mound echoes a sound like the Yes, you keep talking about that. Can you shush? Do 
Do we have everything though? One, two, three, four, uh, five, six. I don't even have a seven. I don't know. For all I know, that could be completely wrong and I'm doing this. I'm jump jumping the gun on this, but... Two. From off in the mound, that goes... Just let me insert these tiles, ma'am. I don't need your commentary right now. I'm busy. Like, I'm getting it's trying to set the atmosphere, but then once you start seeing it too much, you've, <laughs> you're, you're trying too hard now. <laughs> so, hush, please. I mean, the question is, with the rod, am I just going 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, like, consecutive? Is there a password I should be inserting here? From off in the mound. Uh, where's five? This is five. Okay. Six. We don't have seven, though. Back out here. Gabriel has the creeping sensation that he's being watched. Oh, wait. Can we grab this? Or is it fixed? <clears throat> it's stuck. Okay. And it should say and seven, right? Don't. An etched <clears throat> He's It's stuck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so this is seven. Okay, I, I completely missed because that mural thing is there. Okay, seven. Eight. From off in nine. Okay, uh, let's get ten ready so I can like try to insert it right away. Our driver's gonna be like dead by the time we get back out. <laughs> oh, forgot. Okay, so am I just doing one, two, three, four, five? Consecutive order? Okay, we got that placed. Good to know. Now there's no clues about the numbers, so. Let's just try one, two, three, four, five, because this should be twelve. From off in the mound echoes a sound like the scuffle of a Hush. We don't have time. One. <gasps> Nothing happens. Unless this is supposed to be a specific or oh god, I hope it's not like figure out the sequence of the numbers. <laughs> I should get my boogie board ready just in case. Nothing happens. Two.
From somewhere off in the mound, Gabriel hears a soft click, then a rumble. Uh-oh, I have a feeling that did something. Um... Okay, we're not... <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this. Oh, shit. What? Oh, hey, little night, I presume. Uncle Wolfgang. In person? <laughs> now go to it, boy. I can't hold these creatures for very long, and there are more on the way. I'm Go sorry. to what? The secret panel, boy. These creatures are only alive while it's open. Close it, Gabriel, and hurry. Yeah, before he dies, Gabriel, come on. Gabriel, get in the hole. What? Hello? Why can I? Oh, I have to do this. Okay, I have to. I think I found something. That's to close it. Very good, Gabriel. Now stand back. I I'm sorry. That looked like Gabriel you're saying way too close to the entrance. Wow, the inner wheel. Yes, yeah. wheel within a wheel. Are you okay? You don't look so hard. I'm fine, Gabriel. The wheel. You dreamt it? Yes, and you? Yes. I must congratulate you on the three snakes connection. I had missed it. You will make a wonderful shot in Yeager. Who me? Yes, it's a long path, my boy. I myself have still the last of my three quests to meet. But let's see what is here. You have found the heart of the apple, but it might be poisoned still. Okay, we still got mummies here. Okay, what can I... Let's not go... Uh, Wolfgang. How's your heart doing? We probably have a little time here. <laughs> yes, all right. What can you tell me about Schottenjägers? We have not the time to discuss that here. You have started the path. I can see it in your eyes. You must trust yourself and be true to your inner voice. The good voice, Gabriel. You'll know it when you hear it. Okay. Is there anything else you can tell me about Tetelo? I can feel her presence here. I wouldn't be surprised if she knew we were violating her sanctum. Do you think Tetelo's remains are here? I have a feeling that they are, Gabriel. Is there anything else you can tell me about the talisman? The most important thing about the talisman is that it be once again in the hands of the Schottenjägers. Tell me about yourself. <laughs> this is not the time nor the place, Gabriel. I am sorry, but I assure you, my life has not been all that instructive. Okay. Um, right, so... Oh, you just... Look at that table. Yes, it is very old. There is a story being told through the carvings on the side. Can you make it out? A tribesman discovers a snake mound hidden in the jungle. He manages, after much time, to find the secret entrance to the inner reel. In this room, he bows down to a small idol of some sort. The thing is radiating, like a sun. That explains the source of the Gedi's tribal power. They found this mound and the idol in it. Where the idol came from originally is hard to say. But it is definitely older than the Gettys. The idol was probably once kept in this table. But they would have it with them now. It must be destroyed. Okay, you're going the uh, you're off to rest. I just realized your hair is long, sir. Is that also Shall the, we try uh, this family style? I suppose it wouldn't hurt. 
Man, I'm just not giving you any rest. You go off to rest on the side, and I'm just like, hey, get back here. I need your help. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not... Good job. Good rest. Uh, more help, Gabriel. I don't think it would open so easily, though. Very ten strong men. Okay, sorry, your health is a predicament, and I kind of just made it worse. The table's lid fits heavily on the base. At the seam, there are two large holes on either side. On top of the lid is a trough. Okay. Um, so is this where we use... Interesting. The... Oh wait, bars. Hello. What about these help. iron bars? Good idea. Let oh me help God. you. This music is so going. How heavy are these bars? Where are they made out of? Perhaps these holes. Okay. Am I gonna have to wait for you guys to do the second one, or are you guys just gonna do just one? There. Like... No, uh, sorry, Uncle, but I we're I'm gonna force you to work again. Am I? Let's get the other one. Okay, well, I'm just gonna eat my snack while you two men work. <laughs> um. Good job, you guys. Doing great. Super strong. Especially to the older gentleman. You are literally giving yourself a heart attack, but you are dedicated to your life's work, so. Nothing I can say for you. You're gonna do what you need to do, or what you want to do. What you believe your duty is. Okay. No, 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 we're not done here. Get back. <laughs> Unless, Gabriel, can you do this on your own? No. Nope. Let's try to lift this top. <laughs> I love it. He just keeps getting called over. <laughs> I know it's in there. Yes, it is in there. Oh, I've not felt this powerful since, well, ever. Why won't the damn lid come off? It is a sacrificial table. It can probably only be triggered by the proper use of that trough there. With a heart. Oh, great. Where are we gonna get a heart? Gabriel, you must take the talisman and be Schottenjäger. You perform the ritual and dreamt of the dragon, no? <laughs> yes, I did, but you're the current Schottenjäger. I only did that because... Because you were driven to it. I have done nothing with this title for many years. Oh, even in my prime, I had few cases. Ah, no, if, if my life had a purpose, it was to bring you to this point. But I have no idea what I'm doing. It's not a science, Gabriel. It is instinct. And you have it in your blood. Trust it. The castle is yours now. It has many documents and records which will help you in the future. Well, thanks for the confidence, but what about this table? I want yeah. you to go into the next room and get the heart from that dead creature on the floor. Will that work? Doesn't it need to be fresh? Let us try. Perhaps there's some of the old Ritter magic left. Go on. Are you gonna sacrifice yourself while I'm away? Okay, fine, let me turn away. I really hope not, but... Great. My first job was a shot in Jaeger. Cutting up dead monsters. For this, you bitch! Why did
did he go to Africa, Berta? No, it's okay. I'm just a little anxious. No, they haven't. I just need to talk to Gabriel. Okay, so was the old man forced to rip out his heart? Day 10. Deep in the earth, I faced a fight that I could never win. The blameless and the base destroyed and all that might have been. Gabriel Knight. No, but seriously, was he... Like, I thought he was gonna... It almost seemed like he was forced because... Seriously? After arranging for the shipment of Wolfgang's body back to Rittersburg, Gabriel returns to Norlands. He carries with him the Ritter talisman. He has not heard from Grace for over 24 hours and he could not reach Malia by phone. And although he has some idea of what he is coming home to attempt, he still has no clue where to attempt it. I was or going to say, does he? As I was going to say, <laughs> if uh, Old Man Ritter ripped out his own heart by himself, it wasn't for us. Grace, I'm metal. home. <laughs> Grace? Oh no. Grace! Okay. Uh, wait, let's look at this note. The note is from Malia. It says... Gabriel, I hope you survive long enough to get this. Tetelo knows you have the talisman. Your life is worth nothing, my love. I fight to save you, but she controls things far more than I. She has taken grace. Return the talisman and leave Norlands forever. If you don't, I can't help you. Please, I can't bear to see you die. Please believe me. I love you, Malia. Who's there? I have the talisman. Yeah, good for you. I got a headache. You're you alive. Don't come near me, you're dead. Huh? Oh, that was you at the tomb? You should have said something. You mean oh you God. weren't dead, you son of a bitch? Do I look dead? No, wait, don't answer that. I was searching the tomb. When I heard someone coming, I broke the light and got in the drawer. I I'm sorry I brained you, but I thought you were one of them. Christ, you about killed me. I, I said I was sorry. Besides, I owed you one for stealing my badge. If it makes you feel any better, I lost my wallet that day. Your wallet? Uh... Oh. <laughs> uh, I guess you're right. We are even. Like I said. Anyway, we shouldn't stand out here and gab. Someone on the street might see us. Let's go in back and talk. You might not want to check your credit card statement. <laughs> How much? You know what the first flight cost. Okay, now let's talk. Okay. Yeah. Um, don't mention about the credit card. But we thought you were dead, so you know. All right, I don't let's know talk. Actually makes it better. It might make it worse than anything. What can you tell me about voodoo? Well, you're the big expert now, not me. This stuff is way beyond anything I was looking into at the beginning of this case. What do you know about the voodoo murders? Well, you and I know who did them, don't we? But we got to prove it to somebody who'll listen. Do you know anything about a secret voodoo houndfall? Do you know where it is? I have an idea. Great. Let's talk about it when we make our plan. Tell me about yourself. <laughs> I'm scared shitless. That's all you need to know. What should we do about Grace? Them voodoo people have taken her, the goddamn bastards. We have to find her and save her, and we can't count on the police department for any help. So, fill me in on what you've been doing for the past five days. I've been getting smart, that's what. They got me running, I'll admit, but the day a bunch of drum-banging, mumbo-jumbo, chanting magicians can catch old Lightfoot Mosley is the day I die. Can't argue with that logic. Now these guys have it wired, I tell ya. From the mayor to a couple of major judges, right down to the beat cops. The Gettys are untouchable from that angle. But once I really started digging, 
It was like I could see clearly. These guys are into everything that happens in this city. And most people are scared shitless of them. Or they don't know about them at all. Let me fill you in on what I've learned in the past five days. Okay. Have at it. Well, Molly Getty is the head of the cartel. Dr. John is her right-hand man. I learned that much. You sure know how to pick him, Knight. She's not really responsible, though. Because during these ceremonies, she's ridden by the spirit of her ancestor, Tetelo. You don't say. It's true. Anyway, I have something, a talisman, that I can use against them. It will help, but they probably still have a power source somewhere in their houndfall. Also, this whole thing kind of ties in with my nightmares, see? And my family history. My family does this shadow hunting thing, and about 300 years ago... Look, don't confuse me, okay? You worry about all that metaphysical stuff, and I'll just try to catch the bad guys. Yeah, you'd never believe me anyway. Let's make a plan. What do you think we should do? We need to find the headquarters of the Getty Cartel, rescue Grace, and dig up some concrete evidence so that I can take this straight to the FBI. Sounds easy. Uh-huh. Do you have any idea where their headquarters might be? Perhaps. Well, you do seem to have a knack for sniffing out this voodoo stuff. Why don't you see if you can locate it for sure? Meanwhile, I got some things I gotta do. I'll meet you there later. How will you find it? Damn, that's right. If I only had the tracker from my office. I have it. Really? Good going. You give it to me and leave a signal device at the entrance to the headquarters. All right. By the way, I found your wallet. And your credit card. Hey, thanks. Uh, you didn't put anything on this, did you? Who? Me? <laughs> what was that plan again? Oh, shoot. Okay, hold on. Let me skip this. Here's the tracker. Great. Don't forget to leave the signal device near the entrance to the Hound for, And be careful. You too. Okay. Oh, you just... You're gonna... You don't have a back door, do you? I was about to say. <sighs> okay. Well, here's the talisman. Gabriel has in his possession the Ritter family talisman. He'll never forget that it was regained only through Wolfgang's blood. Oh, okay, I don't know why he did that whole turn, but... <laughs> Times dated June 28, 1993. The weather service is baffled by the series of bizarre storms that rocked the south yesterday. Twenty died and close to a hundred were injured. The storms only accentuate the bad luck that seems to have gripped the south. The crime rate for the past three days has peaked to unprecedented levels, and there has been 50 reports of food poisoning in Narlins alone. In other words, keep your heads down, folks, and pray that August will return us to sanity. Warily, Gabriel reads his horoscope for the day. Gird thyself with mercy, arm thyself with righteousness. The final hour awaits. There's a school teacher somewhere who's damn confused. <laughs> I was about to say, <laughs> can you just imagine? You're looking at your like newspaper, the horoscope in your news, the local newspaper, and it's just like <laughs> it's not the usual stuff. It's just like absolutely crazy. Okay. I mean, headquarters. Would it be her mansion? Oh, it's hilarious. He like talks, he looks back and talks as this as if he was talking to Grace.
This is gonna be the same thing, or... Ms. Getty is unavailable, Mr. Knight. Okay, same thing every single time. So it's not here. I just want to make sure... It wouldn't be worth... Okay. Um... Would it be in the bio? Like... We haven't been... Okay, it's gonna... Because we don't have the tracker anymore, right? So I don't know if there's a point to... Excuse me. <laughs> Voodoo Museum. Like, where could their headquarters be? Because I don't know where it is. Can't imagine it being in the church. I'm just like, right now, I'm just looking through. Various areas. Posted under door. Close until further notice. The Dixieland drugstore. Locked and barred tight. A sign under front door. She's gone. Oh, wait, wait, wait. The. Hold on. Would it be here? Right now I'm just looking to see... Hold on. This is the tracker, the signal device, not the tracker, the signal device we need to put somewhere. So if I don't see... It doesn't make sense for it to be in the tomb. I feel like if it was in the tomb, Mosley would realize. Having a look. Nothing. I'm just trying to think. Like the university. Are we going to the late Ponta train? Imagine it. Like this makes no sense. This the whole church thing. Everything off is off on this order. The headquarters. It's not Getty's mansion. Grandma Knight's house. There's the bayou, but I don't know where to travel to in the bayou. The blood is somehow still here despite the supposed I mean I guess let's try the bayou? It's just like last time I needed a tracker in order to unless I mean, he's gonna walk through and just something get in the right bayou air is confusing Gabriel's sense of direction. He could use some less susceptible assistance. Okay. Yeah, I was wondering about that. What a talisman. Gabriel clutches a talisman. He'll be damned if he lets it get lost again. See, I don't know about this. This looks familiar. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, I'm back where I started. Okay. Um, let's look at the, I mean, should I read the notes? 
Actually, maybe I should read the notes just to see what the hell happened. <laughs> okay, day eight. Crest, I figured being out of New Orleans would get me away from those dreams I've been having. But last night was a whoopa. Whoopa. <laughs> At least it was a whole new nightmare plot line. Something about a dragon and fire. I hate fire. Uh, found a key nearby when I awoke. I guess Gerda must have found it and put it in here while out sleeping. I opened up a secret passageway by putting together an image of the talisman. I've seen that thing before somewhere. It looks so familiar. And the shrine is incredible. I wish Wolfgang was here to explain the significance of the stuff in here. I've gotten access to Wolfgang's library and I've started hitting the books. My agent was getting pissed at me during that last black, that last bleak backlash novel because he said I wasn't doing the necessary research. But look at me now, and I'm also learning more about what's going on. Two birds with one stone. The Ritter Library. Finally, the connections I've been looking for. There's a wheel within a wheel burial mound in Benin. That's got to tie in with the cartel's veve with my and. End with my dreams. Did Wolfgang see it too? Day 9. I can't believe I'm here. I hardly ever travel and now I'm skipping around the globe like a bad virus. It's hard to imagine the picture I saw in that book is now right here in front of me. There's a feeling I get from this snake amount of something old and seriously dangerous. I found a tile with snakes on it. I'll keep an eye out more f keep an eye out for more. I have the feeling they're important. Then again, everything here is probably important. There was a long rod carved to look like a snake lying in one of the snake mound's chambers. This thing is old. It must have, been, it must have some purpose. And when I hold it, it reminds me of the dreams I've been having. Shit. I used that snake rod in the hole, and now a bunch of shambling piles of beef jerky are trying to kill me. I need to get the hell away from these things. I had an Indiana Jones moment just now. I wouldn't want to go swinging around on vines all the time, but it did feel pretty good kicking my way through one of those mummy things. I'm here with Uncle Wolfgang in the inner circle. I hope there's something to find here, because it looks like we're trapped right now. We're so close to getting into this altar and seeing what's in there. Tetsilo's remains, and more if we're lucky. Wolfgang seems sure that the talisman is here. He's not looking too hale and hearty right now, but even I've been able to see that his eyes look clearer and sharper when he stands near the altar. Damn it, Uncle Wolfgang. What the hell did you think you were doing? Oh, it's okay. Wolfgang... Wolfgang did do that himself, which, again, really metal. The man ripped out his own heart. Again, leave me alone to figure this shit out. There's too much at stake here to leave it to a novice, and I want to get to know you. Damn it! There had to have been some other way. We could have had tried the mummy's heart. I hate this. Okay, back to the present here. Day 10. Malia left a note telling me she wants me to leave town. That it's the only way to save Grace. I've had some time to think about what Uncle Wolfgang told me, and I believe I got more of an upper hand than I realized. They might have Grace, but I've got the talisman. If this is in my blood, and it's what I'm supposed to do, then I'll have to trust that. Besides, no way am I leaving Grace in their hands. Thank Christ Mosley's alive. Need all the allies I can get in this battle. I've worked up a plan, Mosley and I. I'm going to find the underground Hanfor and make the entrance so... and mark the entrance so Mosley can follow. And then, we'll have to figure it out when we get there. Okay. Oh, wait, sorry. I was there to read the hints. I should technically also be ending the set, but... I know where the Humphrey is, but how do I get there? Oh, wait, there must... There must have... They must have a secret entrance near the square. Someplace no one would expect to find snake-obsessed thieves. And murder sneaking off into an underground lair. Is it in the church? Okay. Either way, I'm going to end set here, so thank you for liking if you liked, thank you for commenting if you commented, thank you for subscribing if you subscribed, and thank you for simply clicking on this video. Until next time, guys, see ya!